Dude, this is the type of stuff that like pisses me off. What are we doing? <laughs> Spark tomorrow is Dark Matter Dame. Dark Matter Kyle Kuzma. Interesting. Okay. Three other point guards. Uh, four of the five cards they're promoting tomorrow are point guards, bro. Like, I promise we don't need any more point guards. They, here's the, and here's the problem. Despite Spark last week also having a couple of point guards in it, it had enough interesting cards to where it was like a solid free card promo, especially because of that Galaxy Opal Tyson Chandler. Like, Kuzma himself is going to be a good free small forward. He might be a borderline great free small forward. Depending on how good his swings are, he could be a really, really good card. But he is the only card from this drop that looks interesting because everybody else is a point guard. And in all honesty... None of them are necessary because if you have Shea Gilgis Alexander and Clyde Drexler, you have two point guards that are better than every single one of these cards that's dropping tomorrow. Not to mention if you've grinded level 40 on the Pro Pass and you have Pro Pass point guard Jokic or a variety of other cards on your team. There is... A, a, there is no reason to grind this. I mean, that's the honest truth. I just don't see a reason why this would be worth grinding for like 95% of the community. And it's just like, ah, oh, another, like this is the content for this week. This is it. Uh, they're not like, we're going to get a locker code tonight. I, I, that's cool, I guess. I, they dropped Opal Tatum as a special offer today in the, for VC in the in the pack market, which obviously I'm not buying, and I hope y'all don't either. Makes me wonder what they're going to drop for the locker code tonight. Are you, like, is it going to be Dark Matter Tatum for free? That would be a really good locker code. That's a better card probably than every card that's coming tomorrow. Like, hopefully the locker code is good tonight, and hopefully we get a locker code in the Mavs game here and then here tomorrow if in game during game four or something. Like, hopefully we get some more stuff, some more content this week, some more whatever. We need something. Because this is like really crappy content. And look, I agree with my boy Jay. Shout out to Jay. Go follow him on Twitch if y'all watch Twitch streams. He streams like more of my team than almost anybody. Same thing with Eggnite, actually. Go show follow, go follow both of them. Um good dudes. But like I agree with them. Like nice point guard. Yeah. I'm not this is not stopping me from loading up other games. And it's not stopping anybody else from loading up any other games either. This is not the type of content that is getting anybody to load up the game because here's the problem. This promo compared to what we got on Friday is like why am I grinding for Damian Lillard and Kyle Kuzma when on Friday we got Goat Shack, 100 overall clay, Dark Matter, Draymond, Ron Artest, Michael Beasley, even Opal Mobamba, Dorian Finney Smith. Like as a whole, we got a whole set here that makes this set useless. Like Kuzma's the only card here that's halfway interesting and I promise y'all I'm not putting three to four hours in grinding for a galaxy or sorry for a dark matter kyle kuzma and realistically i don't think y'all are either for the most part and like who blames you you know what i mean why would you i, I i'm so sick of my team man i really am so sick of them because it's like dude they're dropping this and madden's over here dropping like they're still dropping new promos during the summer and their content is like way better than our content has been in a like dude madden is in such a good state i don't understand how is madden so good and 2k is so garbage madden just dropped a tom brady card that there was a special offer for and yes it was still gambling but number one they have an auction house that you can go buy the card off of number two the special offers they off they drop like give you a super high percentage chance to pull specific cards and to pull really really good things when you spend money on madden you are guaranteed good things and have a legitimately high chance at great things that is not the case in 2k and then the free content in madden the budget content in madden is so much better i mean the theme team's all-star promo they just dropped i bet this crucible this crucible set will be super cool i get excited for madden content and i understand that many of y'all watching my videos do not play madden my point is other ultimate teams are showcasing specifically madden because two i'll say mlb they're doing their own stupid thing but uh i feel like they're showcasing what thing what it can be like and they're actually doing a pretty good job not to say there are not flaws but there have been flaws in the ult ultimate team game mode industry for a long time and at the end of the day it is a business and i do expect it will always be somewhat predatory and there will always be some flaws and things to complain about but it's just reached a whole new level with 2k24 and it's like we got 
consistently exciting, fun, accessible content in Madden on a weekly basis. And then you load up 2K and they're dropping four point guards in a game that has been dropping almost nothing but free point guards as like all of the rewards for everything recently. I mean, like legitimately, this is absurd. Can we please get a position other than point guard? Last week, Spark, we got multiple point guards and the playoffs round. We got Donovan Mitchell point guard, Ant Stinks, um, Zion bad, Aaron Gordon bad, Jeremy Lin point guard um another he can't play point guard point guard there point guard pajewski not to mention the mode reward this past weekend was a point guard in uh trey young the mode reward the weekend before that was a point guard the pro passer version the post pass reward is also a point guard the level 40 is a point guard yes it's a very good one in Jokic, but still like there are so many point guards that's all they're dropping as rewards constantly is just point guard point guard point guard and it's like yes they drop other positions too but generally with the free content recently for the most part it has felt like point guard or garbage with the exception of like one or two cards and literally that's the thing tomorrow too with the exception of kuzma it's lame like maybe the other opal that they're not promoting will be good but in all honesty i don't exactly expect it because if it was a good desirable card you would think they would put it on the promo so like bro we, i promise we don't need this many point cards this is ridiculous nobody's interested in this and it's just like this is the only content we're getting this week before friday which is going to be all gambling how is this the way that this game is in damn near june i mean it's about to be june in previous junes we've been getting like free content every single day a free dark matter every single day not to mention and, and it wasn't all point cards as well there's been way more variety this this has the potential to be great but it requires more i'm not saying they can't drop point cards and i'm not saying damian lillard shouldn't get a card I don't have a problem with Dark Matter Damian Lillard. I have a problem with Dark Matter Damian Lillard surrounded by literally all other point guards. If it was Dame was the only point guard in this drop, or even if it was Dame and one of the Opals was a point guard, it wouldn't be that much complaining because you'd have more variety. But right now, they're like, like it's it's getting worse, not better. We've been complaining about short point guards being the rewards for everything for a while. Like bold last season, I think five out of the four out of the five cards were point guards as well. We got Josh, Steph, um, Russ, and Clyde. And Clyde's six seven. He's a dog, but the other guy are th three are short point guards. Like, dude, I am sick of it. And I know I'm complaining. I know I'm kind of rambling, but like it, there is no motivation and no excitement to load up this game. And it's like, bro, this is totally unnecessary. And it's just garbage. And it's oh, it's incessant unrepentant garbage like i'm gonna be honest i ask you all right now leave me a comment is anybody excited about this tomorrow is anybody excited to load up tomorrow and grind for these cards because if you are more power to you man but me personally i am not and i am very very sick of what my team is doing um obviously we'll continue to make videos and i appreciate all of you who continue to watch and support but damn this is dark it is bleak oh well I hope y'all did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. Fingers crossed the locker code tonight is at least good. I'll be back with more 2K content very, very soon, and I appreciate y'all. Peace.